But when people talk about this fight in extreme terms, like good versus evil, how does that make you feel? Um, that's not really my focus. My job is I always think about two fighters going out there competing against one another, and the best man, the best man will win. And 47 times I was the best man. So we'll see how this fight play out. You know, come May 2nd. Early in your career, you said that it's just about the win. It's about getting the W, and that's all that matters. But recently, you said you wanted to get the knockout. You even apologized for not getting the knockout against Guerrero. When it comes to this fight, is it just about getting the W, or does the entertainment factor into your game plan? Uh, well, a little bit of everything play, you know, plays a major role. But we're going to go out there and dictate the pace from the, from the opening bill and see how, how everything plays out. You know, you're wearing this uh, T-shirt with the, the Filipino flag on it. Uh, explain that to me and why that's important. Uh, we got, you know, we got money team gear for all countries. So, and we support everybody. We love everybody. So, you know, I, I you know, I have American fans, African fans, Japanese fans, Filipino fans. For the, for my Filipino fans, you know, go to themoneyteam.com and get a shirt. Floyd, this fight can make you a record number purse, the most you've probably ever seen in your whole career. But for you, is this fight more important than the money? Um, I'm just, you know, I'm happy that, you know, uh, the fans are, are going to be able to see us two meet May 2nd and um, get them what they want to see. In your opinion, what's the difference? Because I've asked this question to a lot of people, but in your opinion, the difference between a good fighter and a great fighter, and tell me why. Uh, well, a great fighter um, is going to go out there and give it 100%, 100% always. A good fighter will fold under pressure. He have good nights, but a great fighter gonna go out there and perform, you know, great every night. A, a great fighter is gonna, gonna be in the gym and work hard. If one person is is in the gym, or 400 people are in the gym, it's gonna go out there and are, it's gonna give it 100 percent. That's what it's about, giving 100 percent. To whereas a good fighter is gonna give sometimes get 90 percent. 80%, but a great fighter is always going to give 100%. So in your opinion, is Manny Pacquiao a good fighter or a great fighter? Uh, it, that's, you know, that's not for me to rate Manny Pacquiao. You know, I got to rate Floyd Mayweather. Floyd Mayweather is a great fighter. Now looking at uh, this fight, I know your phone's probably been blown up like crazy uh, about tickets for this fight, but who's the most famous person who's asked you for a ticket to the fight? Um, you know, I don't really know. You know, um, I, I speak to everyone on a, on a regular, you know, I talk to everyone on a regular, so, I mean, so many people ask me for tickets, but I've been, I was just focusing on my training um, and hanging out with my daughter and just enjoying life. You look like you're going to try to get the knockout from your training. You look aggressive. You said that your footwork has slipped and that that's how Manny Pacquiao is going to end up getting an advantage over you. Yeah. Do you feel like footwork is going to be the key to this fight, speed, power? How do you assess it? I think Freddie Roach is a great trainer and I want him to keep up the good work.